Hello again everyone, thank you for joining me, I hope you're all well. Okay, so jumping into a new game today. So this is Birding Simulator, and this is just a demo, so it's free for everyone on Steam to uh, try out. And um, yeah, so I saw this. I was looking through for new games to play, I saw this. And I thought, what? I've got to try it. So let's um, jump straight into it. Yeah, so I just had a quick look, just to... Um, we were living in a beautiful, experience it. place. I'll leave this going. We had no idea how fragile and uncertain our world really was. It could happen anywhere. However, it still happened to us. And what did we do? Well, we just had to do something. Lucas, I know we haven't seen each other in ages. That's exactly why I'm going to write rather than call you. You can easily ignore me if that's what you deem appropriate. Do you remember us wandering around the forest? Remember how we admired the nature around us? Remember when we slept in that tent in the middle of the clearing? All of those memories will soon be gone. They'll be gone to us and to everyone else. Factory construction has already begun in the forest. Large sections of the forest are to be felled for logging, and the areas left intact will die off on their own. The devastation will just take a little longer. It's already happening, and the construction has only just begun. They're building the very first building of the complex. And what about the air and water pollution levels, and the noise? How are the animals supposed to survive with their habitats suddenly gone, when there's no food or water for them? There is a way to undo the damage, but I can't do this alone. I need my man of action. I need you and your talent. I have no idea if the cause still means anything to you, but maybe for the sake of the good old times. Lucas, help me, please. If you decide to do so, call me. That was dramatic, wasn't it? Yeah, so this is obviously a very laid back game. Um, when I was messing around on there uh, last night, I did quite enjoy it. It's quite a pretty game. And uh, yeah, I think it's definitely got a lot of potential. Right, come on, don't take too long to load. Here we go. Hello? Lucas, can you hear me? Loud and clear. It's been a while since I've seen Gary that angry. Sounds like you know him quite well. We've carried out a couple of actions together. Did they work out? Some did, some didn't. But it's different this time. We're fighting for our home. Thank you for coming. I'm glad too, Diana. Stop thanking me over and over. Sometimes I wonder if it was right to abandon our project. You're here now. That's what matters. And now try to make your first photo. You can start with a red cross bill. Someone's got to do it. Okay. Right. So, um, we've got um, a phone, which is the map. We've got a camera here, and this is quite something as well. So, if I right click, then it's out of focus at the moment. I can zoom. Um, change the focus so it's on automatic focus at the moment um, so if I press F um, there we go that's better isn't it um, right yeah so look at all the stuff you can do with the uh, yeah the camera there that's pretty cool isn't it what's tab oh right, okay Right, so we've got a photo. You can do burst mode if you want. Um, yeah, so you can turn focus on or off. It's um, quite something. Okay, right, so that's that done. Um, study red crossbill. So we've also got some binoculars. And if we uh, zoom in on something, we can study it. Right, so we know what that is now. Nice. Um, take a photo. So that bit's a little bit glitchy. It wants you to do it the other way around. Right, there we go. 
and he's gone. Um, new mission started observation tower. So I haven't got very far on it. I just wanted to see how it ran really. Um, so let's see whether I can find another calling bird. So you can turn the little um, prompts off. Come on now. So when a bird does a call, there we go. So that's a call there. Um, so that's a plant. Yeah, so there is a bird over there, but that's all right. We'll carry on going and we'll try and find one. You don't have to run either. You can walk, you can kind of crouch so that you don't scare the birds away. So there's something over here. And it's not any birds in it, but obviously this is focused on the birds. So we'll try and find something else in there. Here's something there. You can track too, so if you track it, you can see where it ends up. Oh, I'm doing terrible. Yeah, absolutely terrible. Um, I probably should be using the binoculars. Um, okay, so let's get them out. Let's just launch up there. Right, so that was a rabbit. Look at me knowing all my animals. It's because that book I bought when I was playing Farmer's Life. An excellent, excellent game. Right, anything up here? Okay. It is on high graphics, but I imagine uh, it's probably going to have better settings in the future. Yes, yeah, so this isn't sponsored or anything. I don't know who the developer is or anything like that. I've literally just downloaded the demo. Right, what's that? Who are you? Kill deer. Okay. So if I track it, um, as long as I keep clicking before that countdown runs out, it will replenish it. And then I'll be able to see where it was going. Oh, look at that deer. Lovely. Another one. You can jump. Okay, so let's go and get this observation tower. Yeah, and it's nice to be hey, playing a game. I see the observation tower. I wonder if the view's any different. Go up and see for yourself. But watch out on the stairs. They're damaged. What? They were damaged ten years ago. They've never been repaired. Why? Is there anyone who cares? Why would there be? They've been planning to sell this land to the factory for ages. I don't get it. The locals didn't oppose the sale? We've tried petitions, and we've spoken with officials. We wanted the commission to visit and make a statement as well, but no one listened. The mayor is the factory president's buddy from high school. You get the picture. And you tell me that now? Would that change your decision? No, I don't know. I, I at least know what I was getting myself into. I know it sounds like a lost cause, but we've got you and Gary. If there's anyone who can do it, it's you two. If we win, it'll only be because I'll find that bird. Someone's got to do it. Hey, Lucas, I'm taking you at your word. My goodness. So the character that we're playing is a little bit um theatrical. Um, right. Okay. Now what? Um, yeah, so when it shows up green, them little circles just there, um, that means that we've already scanned that. And then the species that we don't know will be white. Um, right, so there was something over there. And you can get them mid-air as well, as you can see. So I could track it. And as long as I keep it within my thing, before that runs out, I can track it until it lands. There we go. So he's down there. Um, and I don't think I can scan it. I think I've already scanned this. But yeah, he's all right down there. Yeah, so you can turn off the little sound indicators. So that green thing or the white thing. So that's pretty cool. 
Right, so activate. Unlock tower. What a view. Just like the good old times, remember? Looking from here, it's as if nothing's ever changed. We're still 16 with big plans for the future. True. Except now we know the stakes. Look to the north. See? My old camp. I use it whenever I'm going birding. You're always welcome to have a rest there. I'm using the ecologist camp now anyway. Feel free to look around. Thanks. I'll take a look around here. Okay. Yeah, so we need to um get over there. Um I don't know if there's full damage. No, don't break the game, Johnny. Just play it nicely. Oh, my God. Okay. That's me playing it nicely. Right, so that's a point of interest now. So, um, yeah, let me quickly show you the options. Um, so, um, point of interest indicators you can turn off and also bird sound indicators. Um, then we've got our inventory. Uh, so we've got that. This is back at the camp, I believe. Um, photo album, so you can actually go through and uh yeah look at your photo so that was an a minus b plus um missions yeah so we've got to go over to the camp um and so is it yeah here we go so not studied not photographed so this one oh coming soon okay but we have um studied that one um yeah and that one that one and that one nice you can read about them as well. So that's all good. Yeah, interesting. Oh, I should have been f um, taking photos of the ones I found, shouldn't I? Doesn't matter. Yeah, so I don't know how much is kind of in this demo, but I do really, really like this kind of game. It's um, unique, isn't it? Right, who's this over here somewhere? Okay. You. Okay, so I should really be crouching and going over. Can't be bothered. Right, let's go for it. Okay. <laughs> oh dear. Diana, I found the camp, but... What is it, Lucas? I found a message. Get lost, tree huggers. A threat? I'll talk with Gary. And what can he do about it? I know you're not fond of him, but Gary has connections. He's a friend with our sheriff, too. I'll call you when I find something out. In the meantime, check out the functionalities of the camp. Someone's got to do it. Okay. When was the last time you photographed wildlife? High school, for our album. I didn't really have any chances to do it in New York. Urban lifestyle, huh? Do you want me to remind you of the basics? There's no need. Thanks. Yeah, sure. Help me out. To what? be honest, I barely remember anything. Don't worry. Ornithologists train for many years, and you've only got your vacation. I'll help. Together we'll use it to the fullest. Is it really that hard? Birds are timid, and we need pictures. Even if you manage to find a new species, the bird could just fly away. What do I do then? Let's find a bird first. Try to catch any calls. Now that's quite a loud singer. It must be a red-bellied woodpecker. That's a very distinctive call. You can distinguish Eagle. them by their calls? Can't you? Hmm. Hear that? That sound is typical for the red-bellied woodpecker and how I need the one behind it. You can actually learn that? You'll be recognizing them in a few days. Now, try to locate it. And remember to sneak. Are you kidding? You can go ahead and run. All I the wildlife will hear you from a mile away, though. 
Okay, I got it. Someone's got to do it. Uh, let's sneak around. As quiet as possible. Stay low and move slowly. Okay, so let's have a walk through the woods, shall we? Use this. And Piper. Yeah, well, I've worked in the woods before. So what I did in the woods was coppice in, by the way. So it's not actually bad for the planet. It's good. And it was good for ancient woodland. So, yeah, the, the trees do grow back. You cut them so that they grow back. But, yeah, when you're working in the woods and you're that close to nature, when you uh, turn all the saws off and everything, it's weird how animals react. Because, like, obviously, you leave them scraps of food and stuff. And, um, yeah, they realise that you're not a kind of enemy, but they, they'll they never like the sound of a chainsaw. But it's weird, when you put all the tools down and you're packing up, it's weird how animals react once they've got to know you. It's lovely, actually, it really is. Okay, so there's something over here somewhere. I just can't even see it. All right, we've got that one to the right. Yeah, I can't imagine young people liking this kind of thing. Right, what's that over there? There's a point of interest over here somewhere. Trouble is... Right. No, it's too fast. Yeah, what's this? Is it just a rock? Yep. Well, we'll go down here anyway. Have a little look. Maybe these birds don't like the woodland. Right, I think that's really far away. Oh my, I'm really struggling. There we go, well that's not one, but that's pretty cool, isn't it? And let's take a picture of him as well. Um, put them away. Get that out. Right, here we go. Um, it's not going to be great. But we'll get it. That's the one we need, but... I just, I can't work out where it is. So I'll tell you what, instead of doing that, let's just go for a run. Oh. <sighs> yeah, I didn't know how big the map was. But it's that big. Right, let's go back to camp. Because I reckon that bird's... Not fond of... Um, not fond of the woods. We'll go back out to the front. See if I have any luck. Maybe I'm meant to be at the watchtower. Right, that bird there is the wrong one. We don't need this one. We need that one. Ah, that's not it. 
You're making too much bloody noise, mate. Um, let's take a picture of it anyway. My goodness. How big is that butterfly? Right, that bird's gone now anyway. Oh, okay, it was just really close. There we go. It is still quite big, isn't it? Um, there we go. In flight. Come on, you little bugger. Where are you? Yeah, let's go back up to um, the watchtower now. Which is over here. And we'll see whether some height gives us an advantage. Oh yeah, and you can run through the water as well. So there's a little pond over here, I think. Yeah, so it seems like all of this bit of the map is um, explorable. So, alright, you can't go in deep, but I like the fact that it's got water sounds in it. Looks quite pretty. Buggers. Yeah, there must be a reason why this is unlocked. Surely I'll be able to get one from in here now. The game's probably thinking, what idiot's playing this now? Right. Didn't need to duck yet. Up we go. Oh, easy. Um, okay. Right, duck. A duck would do. Is there a duck over there? Right, come on, birds. Sing. Sing like you've never sung before. Um, okay. Right, I'm going to drink some tea and pop you on pause. I'll be back in just a moment. Okay, it's a sodden woodpecker. Of course it likes the woods. Um, so I think I might know how to find it because, um, yeah, woodpeckers like dead wood. And I did notice... There's um, some kind of dying trees over here. So let's have a little sneak over and see where we can find it. Yeah, for some reason, I didn't read the last bit, woodpecker, the most important bit. Okay. I did have a look through these trees, but didn't have any luck. Right, who are you? Oh, nice. Red okay. bellied woodpecker is common throughout the eastern United States. It consumes a wide variety of fruit. Cavities excavated by red bellied woodpecker in dead wood provide shelter for a variety of other species. Just so it's done. Lucas, I have good news. I'm listening. Oh, don't I don't shout. Your order for red bellied woodpecker's photo. You can remind the knowledge and earn a few dollars. Sounds cool. Okay, then. I'll send you mm -hmm. details. Okay, so you can sell pictures, and obviously that one that we just took would have been absolutely terrible. But that's why right, it doesn't matter. This is just a demonstration of it. Right, um... Is he roosting up there? Is he still there? That's the bald eagle. Okay, no worries. Right, so, um, C order details, J. Um. Well, 
orders. <laughs> I thought that's <laughs> a turn, Kelsen. I okay. bet he's trying to get himself a girl. That's exactly what he's doing. It's their breeding season, so you'll hear them a lot. Great job, Lucas. I didn't mention it before, F. but there's a demand for such photos. There's even an app people from all over the world use to order specific shots of certain birds. For a fee, of course. I Try to take fans. a few of these jobs soon. It'll get you some funds for better equipment to take better pictures. Okay. I need birds. Um, send photos. Select photo, send photo. What am I doing? Hello? Can't click any of this. So, alright. Um, main objective this so we've got to find another one um but it might be a little bit easier now and that was just a regular tree that it was in so i didn't need to go detective johnny did i send the client's photo all oh, right you have to come back here all right no, you don't. No, I just need to get one that's better. Okay. Right, it's the one that's making that noise, but I'm really struggling to find them. <clears throat> Which is realistic, obviously. I don't really... I've never done this. Twitching, is it? Okay, let's just have a look through the trees then, shall we? I don't know how high up they go. Oh my goodness, what are you watching? Um, okay. It's like a horror. <laughs> I can't. I'll do it. Yeah, I thought that I'd probably find one in here, but not that I can see. And I know the sounds of a woodpecker in the UK. But I don't know what their call is. We're closing in on one. Who are you? Right, orange. Here we go. Right, nice. So we need to sneak up to this and get a photo. Right, so this is female. Right, please don't fly away. I'm tapping F like a madman. In case it does. Right, let's try that. And we will keep sneaking on it. Oh, where the hell did it just go? You bugger. You absolute bugger. Prick. Um... Yeah, so I think what I'm going to do is end this one here because I'm not very good at this game, as you can probably tell. Let's see whether I can save it. Yes. So let's save it. So I have really enjoyed this, definitely. And um, yeah, I think with a bigger map, this could be quite the game, couldn't it? So obviously this is free. I love the skybox as well. The skybox is really nice. Yeah, it would be nice to be able to explore out there a little bit. 
And I know this is just about birds, but I do really like the fact that there's deer. I've seen rabbits and yeah, some other stuff as well, I think. Yeah, it's a really nice, relaxing game. And for escapism, especially if you like live in a city or something, this would be quite good, wouldn't it? Have your headphones on really loud, just block out the noise around you and just go for a wander through the woods. Oh, there's one so close. He's over here somewhere. No, I'm going to give up for now. But um, yeah, so thanks for joining me, everyone. I do really appreciate each and every view. And if you've enjoyed this, please feel free to join me in the next one. It's so difficult. It's right there, look. Somewhere. Oh, God, come on. You've done your outro, Jolly. Closer. Don't you dare. Nice. My goodness. Gonna have a cup of tea with him. Ah, uh, sorry. Okay, right. Surely, surely that's enough. Um, send the client's photo. Let's have a look. Missions, orders. Um, this one. Yes, send photo. Four hundred squid. Done. Um, right there we go. Um, so that's all of the demo done. Um. So you can explore the map and photograph every bird species. Birds are ready, are you? No, I'm not. I'm not ready at all. But anyway, yeah, so as I was saying, thanks for joining me, everyone. And fingers crossed, I'll see you all in the next one. So cheers, everyone, and bye for now.